the events of the 11th of September have had a shattering effect, a shattering impact on problems of world security. They have also brought into sharp focus our views about nuclear weapons. Whatever the underlying causes, the situation is that we have been confronted by a group of religious fanatics who were trying to disrupt the way of life of many people by violent action and with complete disregard for the sanctity of human life. We have become engaged in a struggle between rationality and fanaticism, a struggle which the rational world must not lose. At the same time, however, it has created an opportunity for a fresh, more constructive approach to the long-standing issues of controlling and abolishing weapons of mass destruction. This opportunity, too, must not be lost. Prior to 11th September, things were going rather badly. Not only has no progress been made on these issues, but in several respects, we have been moving backwards to a greater polarization of the world in a growing threat of new arms races. This has been especially evident in the US de de determination to pursue the missile defense program, even though it would have made, meant the abrogation of the ABM treaty and very likely a consequent buildup of nuclear arsenals by some countries. Furthermore, this pursuit would inevitably have unfolded a new dimension in warfare, the weaponization of space, with unpredictable deleterious consequences. <laughs> 